And let's go back out to that breaking news coming out of Orange, California. Here's the very latest that we have. Several people shot, at least two fatal. Uh, this is at a building complex in the city of Orange. It's about 45 minutes out of L.A. The shooting was first reported around 5.45. I'm sorry, 5.25. We're coming up on almost three hours later. It's almost 8.30 here in Phoenix and also in California. Police say there were several victims at the scene. Some were killed, but an exact victim count has not been made available yet. We haven't had a press conference yet from Orange Police. At least two bodies could be seen, though, outside of the building, one on a second floor walkway and one in the courtyard. Officers confronted the active shooter and an officer involved shooting happened. The suspected shooter was in custody and transported to a hospital in unknown condition. At the scene, there were bloody clothes that could be seen and what appeared to be a weapon that officers are investigating. You can see officers on the scene. You can still see emergency units out there in the bottom right hand corner. Um, all the news crews are there, so I'm sure there will be a press conference coming up here in just a little bit. So because it's dark out right now, it's kind of difficult to see. We want to show you what uh, this complex looks like during the day. That is the street view of this. Uh, again, it's just a complex building area. This is on Lincoln Avenue in Orange, California. Again, like I said, Orange is about 45 minutes out of L.A., so it took a little while for the news crews to get to the scene uh, and try to get some details on what was going on. We tried to get there as fast as possible. Again, we're, we're, we haven't heard much from police at this time, just very preliminary information that multiple people have been shot, at least two fatal from what we can see. And in situations like this, we usually uh, hear from police the same night. So if we do, we will bring that to you live here on News Now because we like to follow up on all the stories that we bring to you every single night. Well, kind of moving into a different direction here, but somewhat the same. COVID-19 pandemic's effect uh, has been on people's mental health and addiction as well. We've seen a rise in crimes across the country. Uh, and it's something, it's a topic that a lot of doctors and specialists are starting to figure out. We wanna go out to a segment coming out of Fox 11 Los Angeles, who's actually at the scene right now, uh, where they're talking about this. He spoke with experts at a behavioral health integration task force about mental health and addiction during the pandemic. 